As the industrial era has been developed, we have a lot of pollution that has been generated. The highest rate of deaths on Earth is due to pollution, about 9.2 million per year. And it is very important not only to do the research, but also to develop the new generation of scientists that they will lead the field. So how we can eliminate the risks to exposure to chemicals from the environment is how we can improve the well-being of humans. We have the, the Center on Climate Changes and Health. They're doing a lot, of, um, a lot of work in terms of studying the changes of the temperature and what are the effects on mental health and also how the changes of the climate affect the ecosystem and also the wildfires has a major effect because they create a lot of uh, particulate matter and a lot of pollution that could affect the human health. So it's a very important issue which again it has a major implication into the changes in human health. we're exposed to multiple factors every day, which can really cause a disease. So one of our faculty has developed a very novel method by which you can monitor every individual to what they have been exposed to. And then you can determine what is the exposure, what is the health effects on that. We also have faculty who is the father of the green chemistry. In other words, how we can make a new world helping to develop sustainable chemicals that you can use them that will not have an impact on, you know, on human health. One point four dioxane, which is a stabilizer of several organic solvents that may can cause cancer. This chemical, it's a water contaminant, it can go to the soil from uh, all the exposures and then it can get up to your drinking water. It's very difficult to be filtered. This super fun is trying to study the mechanism by which this chemical can cause liver cancer. The other important thing about the center is it's one of the few projects throughout Yale that brings four Yale schools together. I'm a big fan of collaboration. I think this is the uniqueness of our department. So we're very good in connecting the department, not only with the other departments within the School of Public Health, but also with other schools of Yale. And then also we collaborate with state agencies, with the community. So it's very important, not only for our department, our faculty to be in touch with them, but also to pass this kind of mentality to our students, how as scientists, how we do the community engagement, how we listen to the community that tell us what are their concerns and direct our research towards that.